We're in Franklin, Tennessee. One thing I like about the South and lots of the East, some of these smaller towns still have a vibrant downtown. These buildings you see left and right are built in the 1800s, 1700s. And right now they refurbish the buildings into what they can use for nowadays. And I just love the way these are. The downtown is still as vibrant as was years ago. And they build some of the newer stuff like down there, you can, may not see it past those trees. It's new brick buildings. But they build it downtown to keep downtown the downtown that we once know. And I just love the way they, they keep it like this. Now this is the town square. As you can see people are walking, people are driving. The stores are open and the stores are, are busy. I love it. old cannons, a lot of flags. Let's see what this has to say here in the middle. And you go down there. And you could go down there. And you go down there. And you could go down there where we just came from. Pretty fun. All these old cannons are cool. People who gave themselves to the war. Even though the businesses aren't the same as it was 100 years ago, but they're still business known nonetheless. Statue for the Civil War. This is the old courthouse right here. It might still be the courthouse, but I have to go check it out. The parking garage back in that way. This is in memory of the law officers killed in the line of duty in this town. The first one was in 1919. The last one was in 22. May they rest in peace for that. And what's the good about this is this is Labor Day. This is a holiday. And it's a busy, busy down here. You know, anybody want to buy an old building? That one's for sale. So it's busy on holiday weekend. Well, there's a lot of stuff here to check out. They still going to a strip mall or a normal mall. I've done the cemetery before, but I want to take a add this to it. This is the McEwen for his wife. He's on the other side. This is for both him and her. Uh, she died 74, but he put down at the very bottom a model wife she must have been one heck of a woman <laughs> 